morning, Eagle family. Today is Monday, March 30th, 2020. The weather today will be partly cloudy and warm. Now to Mrs. Kokemper with more news. Thanks. Today, for live special lessons, you have PE. So please make sure during your specials time to log into your Google Classroom for PE and participate in a fun lesson with Coach Weggs and Coach Holmes. Also today, we are going to watch a quick video on how to mute your microphone during a Google Meet. By doing this, you help support your teacher's lesson without the addition of background noise. And I'm sure your teachers have developed a way to make sure that if you have a question or are gonna to respond to a question, that you can unmute your microphone and then remute it when you are finished. Please watch this quick video on the how to mute your mic during a Google Meet. Hey guys, everyone. This is Matt, the educational technologist over at Bowley Elementary. And today I'm just going to make a quick video on how to mute yourself in Google Meet. Now, I'm using a screen recorder so my uh, video is going to fail, but I already have a link to a Google Meet. And so, right, what I can do is right before I even join the meeting, is I can click on the microphone, and that has me muted, so then I click join now. Um, and then if I need to unmute myself, I can go ahead and click it, then I could be talking to me, and if I want to mute myself again, click it right there. Hope you found this helpful. Thank you. I hope you found that video helpful in making sure that you know how to mute your microphone. Tomorrow, we will have a little conversation about etiquette with chat boxes during Google Meets. And now for Marvelous Monday with Dr. Carr. Good morning, Eagle family. This is Dr. Carr for Marvelous Monday. This Thursday, April 2nd, is Camp Lejeune Community Schools Autism Awareness Day. In honor of autistic children everywhere, I wanted to talk with you about autism today. It's okay to be curious about people different from you. We are all made differently. No one is the same. Isn't that neat? Everyone with autism is different the same way all children and all people are different. As you know, your brain is like the boss of your body. It's what makes you, you. Your brain has an important job. It helps you make sense of the world around you. Your brain lets you understand everything you see, hear, smell, touch, and taste. The brain of a person with autism works a little differently, and that can make it hard for an autistic person to talk, listen, understand, play, and learn in the same way that others do. And autistic children may have other ways besides talking to tell us what they know and what they want. For example, if you see your autistic friend hand flapping or rocking or repeating noises, she may be trying to communicate or she may be trying to calm herself down. This week, as your extra learning opportunity, I would like for you to learn more about autism by watching Sesame Street's Meet Julia video. Julia is Elmo's old buddy and everyone else's newest friend on Sesame Street. Julia has autism. After you watch the video, you can email me and tell me what you liked best about the video and why. You can find the video by searching for Sesame Street Meets Julia. That's Julia, J-U-L-I-A. For Marvelous Monday, this is Dr. Carr. Make it a great day. The choice is yours. Now to the joke of the day. Hi. Are you ready to laugh? Here's the joke of the day. Why do ants not get sick? I don't know, because they have little antibodies. <laughs> <laughs> Let's end with the hero's purpose. At Heroes, our heads solve problems and are always learning. Our hearts are respectful and considerate, and our hands work together for the good of all. Make it an excellent.